Good morning, good afternoon. This is Vincent from Yancy's Academy and I'm very excited for this video because I want to share with you and I want to ask you the following question. Do you have what it takes to be a top performer, to be a top sales professional in 2021? I'm going to ask you, I'm going to share with you 10 questions that I want you to ask yourself. Am I a fit? Am I on the right track? Or what are the things that I need to work on and improve to become a top sales professional? I started the Access Academy a few years ago for the last 15 years. I traveled around the world to boat show, brokerage house, boat dealership, dealer meetings. I'm obsessed with learning the best strategies in boat sales and marketing and sharing them with you so you can have some results. Without further ado, let's get started. So this is a combination. This is a distillation of all my research. I've interviewed some of the top sales professionals. I've read more than 1,000 books on sales, marketing, business development, behavioral psychology. I've spent a fortune on self-development, mentorship, mastermind conference, and those are the top 10 things that you need to have if you want to be a top salesperson today. So without further ado, let's dive in. Number one, is boating or yachting in your blood? In other words, do you really bring that passion, do you really bring that enthusiasm to your work, to your clients? Why is this so important? Let me share with you my favorite sales book. It's called Selling with Noble Purpose by Lisa McLeod. And she was a sales researcher. She studied 30,000 salespeople. And here is what she found, that she found common traits around the top performers. They all had a noble sales purpose. In other words, they had a strong why and they wanted to do the things. That's why they wanted to do the things they were doing. So for instance, for me, boating changed my life. And I always have a little reminder, a little plate on my desk, boating changed my life. Because of boating, I traveled around the world. Because of boating, I visited the world. I had the opportunity to work with Fortune 100 companies, going on the biggest boat show and yachts around the world. And it really had an impact in my life. And that's what I'm so grateful for it. And I want to help other people change their life through the passion of boating. So that's my why. But it's, and I have some students that are telling me, look, me, what I absolutely love is to see the face the smile uh, on the face of the people when they are buying or when they are getting their new boats, right? So what is your why? That's very important. That's question number one. So is boating or yachting in your blood? Are you guys ready? Let's dive into question number two. Do you have good energy reserve? Why? Simply because if you want to be a successful broker, successful salesperson, successful charter agent, there is no time for small talk during coffee break or wasting your time on Facebook, on social media, Instagram or Facebook. Work ethic is the key. You have to be energetic, you have to be productive and always work hard to pursue your company's mission, your own mission. If you're working at boat show, you know, it can be very um, energy consuming. You are outdoor in the elements. And if you want to be a top sales professional, you need to be able to work long hours. Sometimes you need to be able to work in, in difficult conditions. So it, when you have the passion, of course, it's always easier, but it's very important to have good energy, especially in sales today. Number three, are you willing to put pleasure aside? So what do I mean by this? Most boat sales professionals are taking the boating business not seriously enough. Serious, seriously enough, sorry. Sometimes we refer it as a pleasure boating industry, and some people are taking the pleasure side too much. If you want to be a top sales pro, you need to be professional. I know that a lot of people are in our industry because they want to, they're doing because of the passion, but it's not because of you doing it in other because of the passion that you should not be professional, that you, you should not have the, the right dedication, commitment, self-discipline, and work ethic. So this is also very important. Number four, do you have a proven track record of success in a variety of activities? I've had a lot of new students this year and last year and this year that started in the boating industry with no experience on boats whatsoever before and they have done extremely well why because they had a history of previous success in different area in their life right and it's very important if you want to be a top sales performer even if you're not being a top performer in sales in that specific field you need to have a proven success before in your life it can be in sports it can be in art it can be in another profession but 
Why? Because sales is very competitive. There is no silver medal in sale, whether you get the gold or you go home. And this is very competitive. This is very important that you are have that winning attitude. Remember, winning is a habit, but also losing. So you want to have that winning attitude. Next question number five, are you tech savvy? So what do I mean by tech savvy? You, I don't need, mean like you need to be a computer nerd, but you need to be comfortable using your smartphone. You need to be comfortable using video and promoting yourself, your brand and your product. If you're not willing to go in front of the camera, sales is going to be very difficult for you today in, 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 in today's market. We are in what I call in boat sales 3.0 era, which is a very digital, um, there is a lot of screen to screen selling. And it's very important that you have a high technological intelligence, TQ. Yes, it's actually something we're talking about EQ, emotional intelligence. We're talking about IQ. We're talking about uh, social intelligence, but there is a new word that is coming the last few years. It's called technological intelligence and it's your ability to adopt, to sorry, to identify, to adopt and to leverage technology. So it can be Instagram, it can be YouTube, it can be taking video of your products, but it's very important that you develop this. Next, do you have the guts to say, I don't know, I'll just have to call you back when I know the fact. Selling today is about transparency. Most of the time, your customer are going to know more about the boats that you're selling. Yes. And I'm saying that very confidently. Most of your time, your customers are going to know more about your product than yourself. Why? It's very simple. You're not, most of the time, you're not just selling one brand of boats. You're selling a lot of different types of boats. If you look on the boating industry and the boating marketplace worldwide, you have thousands and thousands of builders of super yachts, small boat, big boats, and it's impossible for any sales professional around the world to know everything about every product. Even myself, I've had the opportunity, I've been involved in over 3,200 boat and yacht marketing projects. And there are some days I feel like I don't know very much about certain type of products. And if a customer comes, they're doing research on a specific product, most of the time they will know more about you. So we are not in the BS business at pretending that we know everything. We have to be transparent and it's okay to let the client know that we don't know, we don't have an answer for this question and we'll get back to them. Next, you regularly ask yourself, is there a question I should have asked you but didn't ask yet? So why is that question so important, right? Is there a question that I should have asked you but didn't ask yet? Simply selling today in 2021 is about empathy. You see, there, I like to say, there, I heard that one day, I really like it. There are two types of persons. Someone that enter a room that say, here I am. And someone that enter a room and I said, here you are. If you want to be successful in sales today, you need to have a lot of empathy. What does empathy mean? It means putting yourself in the shoes of your clients, hearing the hear of your clients, and really having that connection. Whether you're doing on screen to screen selling, you, are, you need to have empathy, or whether you're in person selling. So this is very important. And one of the number one rule for successful in sales today is to put your client's interest before your own. I want you to look in the dictionary at the definition of customer and client. A customer is someone that gives you money in exchange for a product or a service, but a client is someone that is under your own care, under your own protection, someone that you are advocating for. And if you want to be a boat sales professional today, marine sales professional, you need to have that client philosophy and put your customer's interest ahead of yours. In, in finance, they call that fiduciary, when you have a moral obligation to protect your client's interest. Next, question number eight. Is your wife, is your partner telling you that you are attractive before going to work in the morning? Why? If you want to be successful today in sales, you must dress for success. You must always be professionally attractive presentable, well-groomed. Remember the importance of body language in person, but also in screen-to-screen -screen situation. If you're in sales today, you're going to have more and more of the screen-to-screen -screen situation. And it's very important to remember the importance of body language, the importance of being well-groomed and presentable. Question number nine. 
Do you have more than 1,000 friends or followers in social media? If you want to be successful in sales today, you have to be willing to become an authoritative, an authoritative figure. And the easiest way to do so is by starting to build a community, starting to build a social media following. Right? You're going to represent a brand, you're going to represent some product, you're going to represent some of the clients both. And you need to build authority in order to have some respect and have some following in the marketplace so you can promote your product and get more clients. So this is very important. Question number 10. We're almost getting there. Do you believe that the key to success is working as a team? Yes, working as a team is so important. Sales is something that you practice individually, but it's something that is played as a team. And especially today, the tools, the resources, the effort and energy required to sell effectively and successfully usually require you to work as a team. You're going to need to have people to help you online, people to help you with photo and video, people to help you with closing, people to help, need to help you um, Technically, there can be surveyors that can be. So if you want the, the successful sales process usually happen as a team and it's very important to be a team player and forget that old school way of thinking of like the lone wolf sales professional today is a team playing environment and that's how you can be successful. So that's our 10 question. And I want you to ask yourself, like how many of these questions did you respond at yes? I'm going to ask you the add one more which is about inventory because we're in a seller market right now and there is a lot of challenge when it comes to inventory so are you a wizard at getting listings in other words are you good at getting listing remember if you don't list you don't last if you don't have a system to get listings you're pretty much guaranteed to struggle in your job you must know how to cons consistently list more boats but at the right price with the right term Forget about dock walking or waiting for your old clients to list their boats with you again. You need a toolbox of listing strategies ready to be deployed at any time. So did you answer yes to eight or more of the following questions? If so, you are on the right track to become a top sales professional. If not, you really need to work on that list. But if so, I want to help you. I'm looking to work with motivated. I'm looking to work with motivated and ambitious sales professional who have some fantastic program at the Access Academy to help you. It's a combination of mentoring, of coaching, and, and training that will help you on a week-to-week -week basis to help you become top sales professionals. So you can have a better life and you can enjoy doing the things you love in life and you can enjoy giving more to the people that means to you to you in your life and have more fun in life so if it's the case with you i would love to chat with you make sure to see below and and, and click on the link marinesalesgrowth.com that's where you 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 can watch a quick video and you and i can go on a call and discuss and see if there is a good fit to work together i wish you an amazing day thanks for watching this video bye